What's up guys, welcome back to yet another episode of Pokemon Septo Conquest. In the last episode we got to the team HQ, we got trapped like a motherfucker. But we figured out all you had to do was teach your Pokemon Dig to get out. It's dumb because it's a glitch that like if you don't have Dig, you kind of get fucked over. But I'm pretty sure if you have an escape rope or a Dig, you should be fine. So from now on, whenever I go places, I'm going to actually carry a carry Dig. So in this episode, they have a gym, which I'm not sure if it's an actual gym or it's like, you know, in Saffron City where they have a fake gym. But we're going to go ahead and check it out. Um, should be interesting nonetheless. Oh, you need to have Cut on your team, right? Well, I don't have anybody on my PC, so it looks like we're going to have to teach Cut to one of our team members. Um, oh, Skarmory is the only one who can learn it. That's great! It's more than good. It's great. So we're going to actually teach... Um, we'll get rid of Leer. If that makes sense. Because, like, if I sand attack, you'll hear miss all my moves and I can just eventually poke him down. But if I Leer, he's going to be switching with me at moves and they'll definitely do more damage than my poor little Skarmory. You all look the same. Which one of us is the genuine Joey? So this guy's in their Joey's. Alright, that's fine. So all I wanted is Benny to get the experience and not Leo, which, you know what, I can understand. It's, uh, it's a problem that's moving around nowadays that people don't want Joey to, they don't, people don't want Leos to get the experience, which is fine. Alright, you're about to kick in my torrent, which is not good for you. Oh, you outsped me, and I didn't do enough damage, actually. Looks like it wasn't that bad for you to, uh, get the burn hacks. But nonetheless, Gohan is gonna show you who's the boss. Damn, getting all of them Thunderbolts in. Oh, I have to check if they have the uh, Thunderstone here. Not sure if they do. Like, it's possible that they do, but it's possible that they don't. I'm actually going to go ahead and check that out right now. After I go heal up, obviously. Because if we can get a Raichu, he could just have some way better stats than Pikachu and could save a lot of time. So let's go to the department store places. What is this again? Oh, it's the coin exchange. The department store, I think. Celadon. This is it still a Celadon department store, man? It's definitely not on the second floor. It might be on the third floor. I don't even know what movie said, but it's probably not good. Started with a C. By looking at them, yeah. <laughs> That's exactly how you identify Pokemon. <laughs> Alright, it should be this one, I think. Yes! Yes! Alright, we got it. That's all that matters. Alright, we're gonna use it right now. Right here in the department store. We're gonna evolve Pikachu. Thunderstone. Gohan. Oh my god, Gohan evolved into Raichu. What? That was completely unexpected, honestly. But I want to see his stats now. His stats must be bonkers. HP still the lowest. With that special attack stat, though. It's weaker than Tauros' uh, attack stat. But that speed is crazy. It's crazy because he actually has the speed. The nature that gives him plus speed minus attack. It's like the best possibility for Raichu. It makes our slams and quick attacks weaker though, which is kind of annoying, but you know, whatever. <laughs> Another problem with Raichu is that it can't really learn a lot of other special type attacks besides like, Electric. So, there's that. But let's go ahead. Xandy City, we've been here way too long. We gotta go ahead and take on that gym and get out of this city. We do not like the city that much, honestly. Alright, so let's go ahead and cut this down. Go in here. Let's go ahead and face these guys. Oh, never mind. Let's not face these guys. Let's face that guy who really wanted to fight us. 
He even sniped us from across the map just to fight us. So I misclicked it and I, I did. Jesus, Ponyta is really strong in this game. Tommy Leon. That was easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Alright, Charmander. You're no match for Benny the Bull. Jeez, that flamethrower did work. Should have probably switched. I don't want to switch into him and then him die to a um, and then him die to a rock that or something like that. Cause that'd be scary. And we could just always confuse hacks for the win. And if not, obviously you're way too slow. Trying to learn protect. What kind of bad move is that? Eye openers. Yes, yes, yes. Blah blah blah. Won't let you die. Okay, so this is not looking too good. Let's heal up. Had no effect on a full HP Raichu. Fire Blast. Stun Spore. What is this? I feel like they all are going to have Stun Spore, man. What is this? A Stun Spore. I'm almost positive that's illegal. And the Super Potion. What is going on here? That's like some BS, I believe. Like, there's no way that's real. Growlithe. Water gun. Growth? What is this? Do they all have Ivy Swords and freaking this guy's moveset? Like, I feel like they do. Alright, so you... Sleep Powder 2. Man. I'm not freaking crit. Right. When you need a Gohan to handle everything on his own. Are you kidding me? Stop it with your stun spores, guys. It's not funny. Look, he has Vine Whip for crying out loud. That Growlithe literally has Vine Whip and stun spore. Okay, this does not look like it's a real gym. There's a, is that a far fetched? Or is that like a Spearow? Not too sure. No, I was thinking you could maybe, like, go through there or something. So I guess it's just a fake gym, which I'm okay with, I mean, I guess. But, like... Super freaking weird. Their fire-type Pokemon have grass-type Pokemon moves. So that's always a weirdo. But I guess I'm not going to lead with Skarmory, because switching in is making me get too much damage for no reason. Let's go ahead and lead with Benny. Poor Benny. I'm not not poor Benny. Benny's in plenty, plenty. All right, let's go ahead and finish this freaking place already. We've been here for forever. Like three more people in a row, so that's gonna be annoying. And the last person is gonna be actually Benny. Finally, after all of this playthrough, we'll finally see him. Benny's horn attack is just too strong. Arcanine. Oof, that's a scary Pokemon. And there's a crit. I am just another cone. I'm getting sick of this. Nah, I'm joking. I'm the real deal. Are my clones impressive? Some guy called Bill snatched me from my home and cloned me thousands of times. If that wasn't weird enough, these two dictators that hired me to be the Baron of this island, I will defend my honor. Oh, I guess it is a Baron. Probably healed soon. Alright, All right, we're gonna go ahead and get that intimidate drop on you. I'm gonna go ahead and actually heal as my first action of this battle. Not the strongest actions usually. It's probably gonna knock out many, honestly. Wouldn't be too surprised here. It did not get wrecked. Horn attack just to ensure that Thunderbolt knocks him out. Off of uh Gohan. You did good, Benny. You did all you could, honestly. I mean, I put you in a shit spot. <laughs> Alright, so Thunderbolt. I'm gonna guess the, last, the next, the fifth gym leader is gonna have level 40s. Which is crazy, because, like, I'm pretty sure the last gym leader has level 40s. In regular situations. 
<clears throat> like if I would have had Surf, it wouldn't be a problem because you know Leo would have an actual strong type water move to use. But all we got is Water Gun, and that's not really doing much. And Smoke Screen. All right, we got the first one, Flamethrower. Eat that up, Leo. Eat that up like it's breakfast. Eat that up like it's booties. And there's a Burn Hex. Not a great way. At least he's hitting both his. Uh... So that flamethrower is gonna drop us into the blade to the torrent range where I will knock him out if I land this. That's what I missed. Clearly, uh, I knew that was gonna happen. Honestly, I had a feeling. So we're just gonna eat that up. I'm gonna go with another super potion just to be on the safe side. It's my last one though, but just to be on the safe side, you know. All right, if I land this, you're Dunzo. You're Dunzo Washington. Are you fucking kidding me, Leo? We never had that problem before, and now all of a sudden you got that problem now. Wow, that's not good. All right, Leo, you um, I, you made me sad today, Leo. Gohan, on the other hand, is being a powerhouse. Um, shoot. Talk too early, and it looks like our second loss of the game is gonna come at the hands of Baron Joey. Baron Joey, but also fucking Leo. I'm missing two fucking water guns. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do some training and then we'll hit back this guy, cause fuck this guy, this guy's hard. So although I didn't do much off screen training, I did quite a bit. I got everyone to level 33 more or less except Gohan. Um, and in that freaking massive grind uh, Bob learned steel wings so that was good all right yes 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 uh-huh uh-huh I already read your dialogue we're not losing to you one more time Joey we've lost to two gym leaders back to back though that's not a good sign I knew now next gym I'm literally gonna get to level 40 at least each Pokemon because I'm not gonna lose any more to gym leaders that's just a waste of time I didn't expect this entire episode to be to be about oh crap <sighs> shit well there's a bad start I didn't expect this entire episode to be about, you know, just training. Oh my gosh. To be about training, um. <laughs> no! Oh, we have no choice. No choice but the ground. Should have healed. Should have healed. We have n nope. We're not gonna. We're not gonna do this. Nope. We're gonna go ahead and grind it until we win it. Literally, what happened is we took Charizard for granted, and I guess we can't leave Gohan. All right. I do need to keep this guy though. But the thing is, one flamethrower knocks out my freaking Pikachu too. So I guess I want to keep Gohan. I want to see what keeping Gohan does for me. You know. That's the only thing I want to see. Typhlosion, he says. Alright, boom. Come on. Come on! There you go. Off to good starts here. Alright, I didn't think he was going to get one-shotted, honestly. Come on, Gohan. <laughs> I'm getting fucking wrecked. Alright, so at least we know we need to grind this game. This game is fucking ridiculously hard. What is it with these level gaps though? Like, Jesus, come on. Like, if you have any more than, like, th those levels will be fine if you have two Pokemon, but if you have any more than two Pokemon, like, it's impossible. Everyone's level 33. I mean, I don't want to grind to level 35, you know? I think I'm gonna have to, though. Yes! Come. Oof. That was too lucky of me. That was too lucky of me. <laughs> well, I got trolled. Alright, there you go. I'm trying to learn rest. I do not need rest. Positive. Typhlosion. Let's go with Leo. Thank you for landing me, Leo. Alright, while well, you're never gonna hit a move, I'm gonna go ahead and take a potion here. 
Alright, you done with that? Alright. Wow. She did some damage in there, I guess. You can lift two hits. Come on, Leo. Come on, Leo. What is it with Leo and getting burned? My goodness gracious, Leo gets burned so much. Either way, we beat him now, but... You can't bet your balls next time I'm not going to take the gym so lightly. I can see the feet you are remarkably strong. I must confer onto you the rainbow badge. Wow, dude, that was hard. You're a good trainer. Take this island. You deserve it. I know. Now that I'm free, I can get on with the rest of my life. Have this. From Erica. Put the Team 19 in his case. Now I am the ruler of this land. I can do whatever I want. Freena plays a James Blunt song. Oh, God. Joey loses the will to live. Joey is dead. He won't respond. A James Blunt song can still be heard playing. Poor guy. Wow, that was so dumb, dude. I am literally grinding to level 40 next time. If you don't even, you don't even know. You don't even know. I'm gonna go heal, and I'm gonna look at that time map because I have no idea where to go next. I'm gonna guess you want to go through like the cycling road or whatever. But then again, who knows? I have no idea, honestly. So we're here. We've been to Necron City. Have we been to Necron City? I feel like we haven't. I feel like we came from Balthia Rock to here. Um, we might have been to Necron City though. No, we were in Ares Island actually. Yeah, we were in Ares Island and then we came up here. We haven't gone here yet. Uh, maybe that's where we gotta go next. But according to freaking Fire and Leaf Green, our next destination should be the through the cycling road. But what if we don't have bicycle a cycle? Because I'm pretty sure we don't have a bicycle because it was closed or whatever. Um I was like, what I have 18 great balls, that was weird. Um, so yeah, I definitely don't have a bicycle. But let's see if what, what lies ahead this way, because there's like, this like where second door should be, you know? I guess they don't care in this game. Oh, okay, so I guess you don't need a cycling road, or bicycles. What's in here? The broken subway. I guess that's another place you can go, I don't know. What's over here? Cookman's house. Oh, it's retarded Cookman's house. Oh, it's not a retard Cookman, it's a regular Cookman. Dun dun dun, it's me, Lance. Have you got something for me? You have? I demand it now. I don't know what he wants. I guess I don't have it. And I guess he gives me strength, which I'm probably going to need in the future. Um, this guy wants to battle? This is my turf. Alright. Did he have a freaking bicycle game with a bunch of numbers on it? I think he did. That's true as fuck if he does. Oh no, just mono cy mono cyclist. Lao. Alright, so man. That was a hard gym, man. Alright, so there's Cookman's house. I guess we go through the broken subway then. I guess we don't have a lot of options. Do we? Do we now? This is the one that goes um horizontal. The other one's vertical. Um, so yeah. There's this. I guess this is what's gonna lead us to Saffron City. Or, you know, whatever it's called in this game. This used to be a subway, but it got shut down after a hideous crash happened here. Oh, no. Necro City? That's what it was called, I think. Hey, you. Want some alcohol? I mean, I'm not going to ask you for it, but if you offer me, I don't think I'm going to say no. You know? So, these are strong Pokemon. I should have just probably come here to grind. For the gym. Ah, I got freaking cagged it. I was like, there, whenever there's an empty piece of grass... In a lot of surrounded by a lot of grass, I was like, there's probably an item here, and then boom. Eight freaking lone berries. Look, there's gonna be an item here too. No item here. Oh look, that's a scary like rape line in freaking Pokemon. Alright, this is the rape line. I used to call them the rape line, but this is like really good, so what you do is or what I used to do at least is um I used to um come here and use my versus secret. That's what I do to train, like whenever I'm like, oh I'm gonna go off screen train. All I do is literally use um, the versus recorder because, or the versus seeker, whatever it's called, because it gives you. It fights all the trainers, and the trainers give you a lot more experience. Like this chick alone gives you like almost a thousand experience from fighting here. And our Pokemon are weak. Like it's not too hard of a challenge or anything. Like look, 350 plus another 350. That's 700 plus another 350 is 10. I don't know, 1,000. That's a thousand experience from fighting this guy. Not that girl. From fighting this guy, you get not that much actually. But 634 is not the worst for getting one-shotted, you know? And then this girl gives you... Oh, 
almost 800. So that's like a that's like 3,500 experience for finding these people. So you just go boom, activate your versus seeker. Not all of them are ever gonna want to fight, but you know that's normal. And then boom, there you go. Let's put Leo in the front. I think not everyone's level 34. Never mind, we good. We good for now. This is a original route though. There's never actually rain in Fire and Lifting, I'm pretty sure. Go fairy, go fairy, boom, get wrecked a ton. <sighs> Alright. Oh look, there's an ape. Or just a scientist or something. I'm pretty sure I saw a guy on the rock. I'm pretty sure I saw a guy on that rock. Probably going crazy though. Yeah, it's just a regular super nerd. Alrighty. I want a chance where I can use my you know steel wing without it being resisted. That's all I've been wanting all this time. Ever since you were started Pokemon Bob, you've been good to me. But uh, it's time we uh, get you to start being stronger. You're strong though. You're strong as fuck. I'll be honest. All right. So if we just use Cut here, we get more experience too. I'll take that route. All right, for Fairy, let's go on to the next person to go to the 35. To the 35, yeah. Don't be so mean to my Clefairies. And then, oh, so this is Lavender Town is where we're going to. I mean, we got the Silph Scope, so I guess that makes sense, you know? Vulpix. That's not cool. Alrighty, boom. Dunzo. Riku Village. It's always raining here, I noticed. The good the good thing is that we're never low on water. Well, that's, I wouldn't say that's a good thing. It's a thing. It's definitely a thing. Alrighty, my grandfather was once an inmate at Deadman's Castle until he got in a fight and died. Okay, you don't talk to you anymore. It's always raining here. I think the villagers must have once offended Magneto 20 and NAP 515, and this is our reward. Guess that's like the developers or something. Can I swipe your wallet? Why would you want to, man? For money, idiot. <laughs> Duh, why else would I want to do that? Are you crazy? Are you are you dumb? There is literally no other reason that I would want to strike your wallet. So let's go. Deadman's Castle used to be a huge prison. All the graves represent all the inmates who died. Oh my god. This is a spooky place. My brother is part of Team Solar. Should I care? No, but I like telling people stuff. Stop it right now. Stop it. Alright, this is Deadman's Castle. Alright, we're not going to go here this episode. I just want to talk to these guys. Maybe they get a free item, you know? What are you looking at? You want my alcohol, don't you? Tough. Now shall I rate nicknames? Okay, so this is the name. Name Raider. So I guess if we want alcohol, he just says tough. He doesn't give us alcohol. Oh yeah, this <laughs> look at how they cut off the freaking tower. They literally just blocked it completely with the waterfall and all that stuff. Maybe you can go in there if you have waterfall. Maybe I don't know. This would be Hurl's house. Oh dear God. Hurl's pass out drunk. It's really peaceful now that Hurl has gone. Jesus, hi, bye. I think Hurl died. This is really Hurl's house. I don't like him, but he adopted me. Oh god, stay away from me. It's so warm. Men are so nice to hug. Okay. Go. Why did I say go away? That guy was like drunk as fuck though. He's either drunk or dead. Either way, pretty spooky. Man, do you like Pokemon? Yay. I also think you suck. Oh man, that's not nice. Ooh, we got some more training in this episode. Pokemaniac. Yeah, yeah. I feel like they took out, luckily, they took out the Dark Cave or something from this game. Because I would have hated to go to the Dark Cave, honestly. That would have been a bad team in my life. I just want to see it, honestly. Oh, look, there's an item here. Nana, Barry. Nana, 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 nana. I guess I did take out the dark cave. There's not even an exit to it. You get stuck inside somehow, you're Dunzo Washington. Unless you have Dig, which I'm never letting go of my... Never making Leo lose that move, which is dumb because I should have just taught it to, like, Tauros. I'm pretty sure Tauros didn't have the option, I would have done that, but... I was kind of, you know, like, in a really sticky situation. I was like, crap, if I have to play this game all over again, I'm gonna be screwed. There's no rock tunnel here, so yeah, I guess I just programmed that rock tunnel, which... You know, I was actually kind of worried about in this game. I was like, oh no, I don't want to do Rock Tunnel. Rock Tunnel is such a, such a dark place. It's a dark time in my life, you know, I don't want to do that. 
But besides that, I think we're done for today. I think in the next episode, we're going to go ahead and see what Dead Man's Castle is all about. Oh, look, we can go south here. So that's how we get to Fuchsia City or whatever. But we'll do that also at a different time. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, please leave it with a like rating. It means a lot. And thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Infected Xenon. Have a good one, guys. Yeah.